Hello, freaks and geeks, and welcome to another episode of War Thunder. And well, this is actually some uh, some post commentary. Uh, main reason is because I had my mic muted again. Um, <laughs> I know it's it. I don't know why or why it happened, but for some reason my computer defaulted to the. Uh, um, to no microphone, but anyways, this episode, we're gonna be flying out the Hurricane Mark IV. Yes, the Mark IV, I'm remembering correctly. But, um, but yes, and as you can notice in the background, there's some nice Halloween decoration. This, this was recorded on Halloween, but, um, it, what I'm gonna be showing is, um, I believe three matches, yes, three matches, um, of this plane. Now, it, I must admit they're not exactly the best matches um in the in the game or what or that I could really you know get because there wasn't like you know uh, six kills or anything like that but they do kind of show off the plane and um I'm I'm going to do another episode on this plane um if not next um next arc, uh, part it's probably going to be the one after that um, because I'm, I'm actually in the, uh, I'm highest in the British tech tree right now. I'm really wanting to, you know, unlock more German planes and play those, but I'm also kind of wanting to unlock more American planes and whatnot just so I can have them unlocked and ready for, you know, to make videos about them if, if I ever want to or whatnot. But, um. But yes, I believe we're going to be hopping in the match here very shortly. And, uh, and yeah. <laughs> I, I, I'm sorry, it's just this, this post commentary is very weird, especially the, for this, um, for this first part, because I was totally doing another intro, uh, from what I'm remembering. Um, but I guess I should be talking about, uh, the plane itself right now. Um,. You know how it handles and whatnot. Now, the the best um, the best way I could really describe this plane is that it's a it's a really good boom and zoomer, but um, and it does turn decently. Um, it's not exactly the best turner. I wouldn't you know I wouldn't turn fight with this thing at all, in my opinion. But it's also their energy retention is also not that great. So you're you know you don't exactly want to be doing um, a lot of uh, really a lot of maneuvers with this plane. I mean at least from what I've flown with it, um, and and well this is arcade not realistic, and uh, in, in realistic there's a lot it you know it's really different. Um, it's a really different uh, play style, but. Uh, but yeah, uh, yeah. And plus, Ar I mean, arcade is a lot more just faster pace, um, and uh, really, you can make a lot more mistakes with you know, it, and it's very forgiving. With a, you know, with realistic, you know, you don't have reloads in the middle of the air and stuff. Which, by the way, I'm probably gonna start doing some realistic battles, but uh, you know, it, you know, I'm just have to get the get better at them. But here I go, going for an attack. Um, not exactly getting the best um, attack attack angle on him. To be honest, I really shouldn't have fired as much as I did on him. But, I mean, what can you do? I mean, I was just... <laughs> this is arcade. And, I, you know, and I, my thinking was, oh, I, you know, I don't... I basically have unlimited ammo, so... Why not take a couple of pot shots at him? And uh, that AA really is getting close to me. But um, but yeah, I, I would just do this with this plane a lot. Is uh, it, if you can, um, if you can, just if your attack run fails, just try to try to you know get back to altitude and uh, have that altitude advantage. Now this guy, he was. He was firing at me, and I believe it's a biplane. Um, and this is one of the. Uh, I'm not quite sure. Is is that the biplane in this map? Actually, no, that's not the biplane. 
but as you can see this thing can turn or not turn but um, dive on a dime and uh, that's one of the things I really love about this plane is that you can just flip it over and um, on its back end it can nose down really really fast um, I believe uh, that's yeah that's not the biplane I, I, to be honest, it's been a, it's been like a couple of days since I first played. This. Actually, no, yeah, that is a bike lane. Um, you know, you could probably see what type of plane it was, but in the in the preview that I have going right now, I can't even really tell what type of plane it it is. But yeah, that that is the bike lane, and that's one of the things with this plane with its battle rating is that you're gonna <laughs> you're gonna actually be facing biplanes. Um, and uh, I, during that whole engagement right there, I was just basically being bait, uh, <laughs> try, you know, trying to get my. I, I, to be honest, I wasn't sending you know radio messages, you know, saying cover me. Granted, but I, I was just basically just playing the bait. I mean, I, don't get me wrong, I was trying to turn on him, trying to be you know trying to be uh, offensive, as well as you know defensive, but. Uh, and, and as you could tell, he peppered, he peppered my plane. Not exactly in anything too too bad, but I mean, still, you know, it's pretty shot up. But I got, I got a hit, um, which was actually very rare, rare because most of the time, um, this plane is a one hit KO. <laughs> Just like one, you know, if you hit him with your cannon shells with this plane, with that, with those forty millimeters, I believe. Oh man, it, it, it just, it destroys, it destroys, but uh, I believe we're ending up uh, on, you know, ending the, the match here pretty soon, but uh, that's one of the things I actually, I kind of want to, oh yeah, oh yeah, head on me bro, <laughs> head on me, and now, I, I, that's, and that's actually another thing with this plane that I've kind of noticed that people have been kind of, I mean, I don't know, it's just, it's from my experience, I, you know, I'm pretty much a, you know, I'm pretty much, you know, very bad at, you know, looking around and, you know, seeing what people are saying, you know, what most people are saying for sure. Um, but, I mean, at least from what I've seen, most people are kind of split on the, about the head-ons with this plane. Some people say, go ahead and, you know, head-on all day with this plane, and other people say, it's not a good idea. Now, don't get me wrong, with, if you're head-on with certain planes, it's not really a good idea, no matter what plane that you are flying in. Um, but, I mean, for the most part, if, if, you can get, if you can get that one good shot in a head-on, um, uh, in a head-on, then, um, you know, you know, then go ahead and take it, uh, but don't, you know, exactly commit to it or anything like that. But, uh, oh shit. And sorry about that, <laughs> for that, like, that random ass kind of audio cut in the middle. For some reason, um, my preview went in black, so I didn't know what was going on. But, uh... <laughs> But anyways, um, I forget exactly what map this is, but, uh, what, what was I talking about again? Oh yeah, those 40 millimeters, um, before I was talking about head-ons. <laughs> um, those, yeah, the, anyways, these 40 millimeters, um, are one of the, I mean, at least for, you know, the tier that they, you know, that this plane is in, it's one of the most devastating guns that I personally have flown with. Now, don't get me wrong, there's a lot more devastating cannons um, in the game, especially down in the uh, tech tree. But, I mean, as... I, I believe this is only rank... rank 2? Um, uh, rank 2 plane? I, I'm not really... I, I'm kind of forgetting off the top of my head. Uh, <laughs> you, you can see it in the beginning of the video, but that just shows me how much knowledge I do have of, the, of this plane. But um, trying to go in for a uh, a nice diving, swooping attack, and almost colliding with that plane right there. 
Um, and, and that's one of the things with this plane of how you have to um, attack, especially with these with these cannons, is that these cannons have a really, really slow velocity um, compared to a lot of the other cannons in um, in the game. Like the, uh, uh, I, I'm forgetting the name of the plane off the top of my head. I'm being such a doofus right now, but uh, the plane that I flew in the previous part, um, yeah, that had a you know lower mo uh, velocity than um, you know than machine guns. Than my normal machine guns, but there was still pretty high velo you know, velocity, and you know they didn't really drop down as much as my can or my machine guns. But these <laughs> these cannons, you can definitely tell um, the the, mu the muzzle velocity. I just how or, or just the velocity of the shell, just how just how slow it is. And because of how slow it is, you really need to go for a nice um, diving, swooping attack from like the six o'clock, or, or even um, go into like kind of a T-bone um, kind of maneuver, where where you uh, where you like meet them somewhere in the middle of their uh, of their loop. But I'm um, firing at that dude, um, hitting him with the cannon. Um, I, at least I think it was a cannon. If you get hit by that cannon, m most likely something is really wrong with your plane. You know, you probably lost some type of control surface or, um, you know, or disconnected some type of uh, the, the fucking rudders or whatever. You know, something inside the plane, you know, is most likely broke, is broken if, if you get hit by these 40 millimeters. And um, as you can see, my teammates finished him off, which was good. I mean, you know, I would rather, I would rather help my teammates uh, finish someone off than, you know, me getting the kill. You know, completely. But, um, oh no, we, this, this screen is black again. Oh no. Oh, uh, there we go. I was, about, I was about to say, last time it was, um, it came back on, but, yes, <laughs> here we go for our last, um, for our last uh, match, and I must say this has to be one of the most satisfying kills I've had in, in a while. Um, I'm kind of disappointed I didn't actually get my reaction in the game down because it was a uh, it was pretty funny, I must admit. But um, but firstly, before we get that awesome kill, we're diving down on this uh, on this PBY. Uh, I, I actually no, we're not. I think we. I think I spoke too soon. Oh no, yeah, that's a P2A. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's a different. Yeah, that's a different plane. Um, I think we get a kill assist off of him. Um, no. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. See. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, it not. It's not the PBY. Yeah, I kind of spoiled it for later. But, uh, but yeah, this little preview that I have going with, um, going on right now, you know, sometimes it's just I can't tell which plane, uh, what, what plane I'm looking at right now. But, um, but yeah, I'm going after this dude who's going after our ground targets, and I do believe we only get a kill, a kill assist off of him, because, yes, yeah, we did hit him with our cannon, which... Look like was directly in the body, uh, in the body of his um, of his aircraft. So something, something has to be broken within uh, within this airplane. I don't know exactly what or what type of damage it was to, um, or if it showed any on the on the right side. But we should be getting a kill assist here pretty soon. What's going on exactly? I think he crashed. Yes, he crashed. <laughs> oh, I mean, he, he crashed. I, I actually forgot all about that, yeah. Um, and for some reason, we didn't get credited with the kill, even though we hit him with a... Uh, <laughs> with, with, you know, full burst of, uh, or, you know, full two shells of, uh, 
40 millimeters. But anyways, yeah, here's here's the um, here's the PBY that I was talking about before. <laughs> and he's dead. I, that and oh, and also that hurricane too is um, right behind us. But this this is what I'm talking about. Like that, you know, PBYs has especially an arcade has like this notorious um, this you know it, they're really notorious of just like eating up so much damage. And me and this um, hurricane, I believe it's a Mark II, is basically going to this. Um, I think. I think it's some it's some weird type of vertical scissors. Not exactly vertical scissors, but yeah, kind of a little. But um, I should be popping flaps in here uh, anytime here uh, really soon. Here we go. Yes, and <laughs> there we go. <laughs> That's one of the most awesome kills I've ever had in War Thunder. One of the best kills ever that I have ever had in War Thunder. I was so ecstatic, and I actually ended up crashing the plane um, soon after that. But yes, I'm going to end the episode here. If you like the episode, please give it a like, and if you want to have live, update, live updates, please follow me down on my Twitter below. Links to this game and everything will be in, down in the description. But I'll see you guys in the next video. What fun is there in making sense?